I'm getting ready to give Zoe a bath, but I wanted to show you what I used for her in Raven. So it was about that much almond oil left in it. And I added some neem oil, a vitamin E, coconut oil, olive oil, oh, and flaxseed oil. I do have some essential oils that I might put in it, but for right now, I just want the actual, just the oils. And I'm gonna warm this up a little bit so it won't be so cold on her. Here's the shampoo that I made for her. I've got it warming up. This has Castile soap, it has some tea tree oil, lavender oil, a little bit of eucalyptus, and some lemongrass, a little bit of citronella, and it's made with green tea, chamomile tea, lavender tea. I steeped lavender flowers, chamomile flowers for a while. I opened up the tea bags and just steeped them all together. I filled another jar with oatmeal, probably about, I want to say two cups of oatmeal. And then I put about a cup and a half of hot water in it and I let that soak for a long time and then I strained it repeatedly. I strained all the oatmeal water out of the oatmeal and just did a repetitive process until it broke down. Then I shake this up real good and it's been working wonders for her little tail. She had an allergic reaction and she lost the, tail, the hair on her tail and it was swollen but she's doing really good now. have an unamused puppy. It's okay. Okay. You're not amused, huh? I have some cotton balls of witch hazel and I do her ears with a lot. Aren't you special son? <laughs> you can see some of the oatmeal chunks in it, but it's okay. Just gave Zoe a bath. I'm not sure how much of it was recorded. Round two, fight. Seen on fish, it's so cute. 